Okay. And what colour, background colour will give it to this one. So I'm wondering, again blue. Okay. Okay. I'm going to add a smidge, or well, it's not quite a smidge, but a fairly smallish amount we don't want to make it go too blue we don't want to blend it all in and make it look shit house we just want to make the blue a little bit stronger right what do we got okay it's this one vision this is a Chinese English, from what I can tell, I had a, a quick look at it to see how much of it was English and how much of it was Chinese, and look at that, it's an A4. I was expecting it to be smaller than an A4. So that's a really pleasant surprise. We don't have to fight around here with the enlargement or the reduction. So let's see if we've made this come up a treat. Okay, out comes the first one. Let's see if it see if it needs to be changed or made better. Now that's interesting. I don't know if I really like it or not. It seems to be. I'm just thinking a better contrast against the face would be welcome. So it's not bad. It's still quite nice. We could do something better than that, I reckon. So let's see what else we can do to make this one even nicer. Because blue looks a bit like it. It's not blending too badly, but it could be a lot better. So now we're going for magenta. And we're just going to go here. And maybe we'll add a bit of maybe red. A little bit of red. That's an interesting one. Let's see how that goes. So let's just see how this one goes. It's just got to be nicer if it contrasts with the, the colours of the face. I think brown would probably blend in, blend into the background too much, possibly, because it's almost a ready brown like you can see here. So something different for a change would be good. So let's see how this one goes. Okay, magenta. Now that's an interesting result. Yeah, I'm just wondering if we can just keep it call it quits it's a tough one but it is quite a nice looking color I guess we could go 